Hello everybody, this is what we're gonna end up doing today. Having a character controller in an XR rig that can move around by just walking in place using your own gate. Let's begin. Let's create a new Unity project. I'm gonna call it Gate Tutorial. I'm gonna make a high definition rendering pipeline because why not? I'm just gonna close the window down and then we're gonna open the package manager. Now, the packages that we need are in the preview packages section. So in advance, we're gonna show preview packages and then go all the way down to the XR section. We're gonna install the XR interaction subsystem package, then the XR plugin management package, and finally, the XR interaction toolkit package. Once all of this is done, we're gonna click yes to enable the new input system and disable the old one. Unity is going to restart and based on your computer speed, your mileage may vary. Now, we do want the old input system as well, so we're going to go into the project settings and into the player tab, we're going to go into the active input handling, select both and then apply. Unity is going to restart again and again your mileage may vary, but I'm going to speed up everything for your own sanity. Once this is done, we're going to create a new scene, add a plane and make it 50 by 50. This is where we're going to run. And then in XR, we're going to create a stationary rig, set the tracking origin mode to floor. And then in the left and right hand controller, we're going to remove everything that we don't need. I'm just going to leave only the XR controller component. Finally, we need to enable the Oculus plugin and we are good to go. We can check in the bottom right game window that I'm actually using the Oculus and it's working fine. It's now time to import the assets. You're gonna do it through the Unity package manager but I'm gonna do it externally because I made it. We're now just gonna eliminate everything that we don't need. So all the example scenes, the materials, the models and the prefabs, the creator examples everything that we don't need. We just need the bare essentials. We're gonna click on import and once it's imported, we are ready to use it. The way to use it is to click inside the prefabs and drag the player just above the camera offset and inside the XR rig, reparent the camera offset to the player and in the inspector for the player, drag the main camera into the camera slot. The rest, like the directions to follow and the gate controls can be left to the defaults because I find them to work quite fine, but you can play around with them and see what works best for you. If we press play and walk in place, and I'm also gonna turn around, we're gonna end up with the same situation that we've seen at the beginning of the video. And here we are, I'm running around the area, even though I'm standing in place. Well, that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, it lasted less than four minutes, so, must have been good, eh? And uh, I'll see you next time.